Hi, I'm Gabe. Hi, I'm Nayeli. And today we're going to be doing a reaction to Itzy's Dala Dala. Uh, the music video came out a few years ago, but we figured with their comeback being at the end of April, we wanted to do a recap of their past music videos and just relive our joy and our excitement for them. Yeah, for sure. We've only seen this music video three, maybe four times, so it's going to be still, it's going to still feel kind of new for us. Alrighty, so let's get started. People look at me and they tell me, when I'm So why don't you stop? I'm sorry, I don't care, don't care, really don't care. something with their hands or in a clock form yeah we've seen txt do it yeah right um i don't know i just i just love that choreography <laughs> I don't know if I could do something like that. <laughs> I'm so I'm afraid of heights. Yeah, so I don't think I could dance on top of a car. <laughs> no, no, I, I I could not. And then I just really like this uh, the lyrics from here. I feel like I truly feel like they're talking to me. Like, oh, Wait. they've got my back. Yeah, I like it. <laughs> <laughs> it's sweet. <laughs> I, I really like that part where they all kind of just pause for a second and do a little pose. Yeah, yeah it's, it's definitely. <laughs> I think there's been like a couple performances when it doesn't work out like the way that it should. And the last person, I don't remember who it is, but they're like far off. So I think it's I think it's actually Yuna that might be with next to Yeji or something. I don't remember. And she's just like this, like all far away from her. Oh, like in, like without anybody? Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. I, I know that they've changed up like their 
kind of mannerisms at that one part. Yeah, but I mean, I, I it has to be hard to yeah. do those choreographies. Like, it's just crazy. I feel like they just have such... I feel like they've set the standard so high for other K-pop uh, choreographies because theirs are just so good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I I forgot that Virgin ended up being in the center at at the end of the at the end of the video. She started and she ended it. Yeah, so yeah. I, I don't I didn't even remember that anyway. Yeah, for <laughs> sure. But it still carries a lot of excitement for us. Um it's very it's a very memorable performance in my in my opinion. Oh yeah. Just because of their debut and, and yeah. just the overall love that they got when they first debuted. It was it was really, really cool to see. Yeah. I love, all of their songs, I think, spread a message of loving yourself, accepting yourself for who you are. And not just that, but truly, like, going the next the, the next step, which is to truly love everything about yourself and not care what other people think about you, no matter what their ages are, no matter what their backgrounds are. It's like, I am not meant to fit your mold. I am my own person. And I'm gonna love that. I'm gonna love myself. So I, that's what this one says. But I think that that's a very major theme that goes across all of their music. So I love that this is a message that they're spreading for their audience for us midsies. <laughs> yeah. <for laughs> because sure. you think, um, like, there's people of all ages who are listening to this. But I think while everybody, while it's important for everybody to hear this message, I think it's very important for young boys and girls to listen to this message and to grow up with it because then that just sets them to have a life where they're not so self-conscious yeah no i i agree <laughs> and definitely like the song says it's okay to be different so um yeah so that's our reaction to it sees dada dada uh, like we said be sure to be on the lookout for the other reactions to the upcoming music videos and we'll definitely be getting excited and preparing for their comeback on April 30th. Mm -hmm. So stay tuned. All right. Bye. Bye. <laughs>